de bok kan gaan. Maar het is de jonge Amerikaanse Ellen Noble. Ellen Noble is famous for posting videos of her doing insane tricks, bunny hopping barriers, riding upstairs, going over logs, all sorts of cool stuff. Ellen, these stairs are the bane of my existence. Can you help us out? I'll at least try. <laughs> she can try to teach me, but I'm a 40-year-old dad. She's a 20-something world-class cycle cross racer, so I hope, to, but not confidence. Every time I ride to work, I think Ellen Noble could ride up these stairs. Every day when you ride to work, you need to think Ian Dilly can ride these stairs. <laughs> Don't worry about me. <laughs> <laughs> it's really, they're really long. <laughs> All right. They know, they're hard. Ellen's first attempt at riding the stairs was honestly kind of scary. I was thinking not only is Ellen Noble not going to ride these stairs herself, we're going to be responsible for ruining her cycle cross season. That's not like the last one. <laughs> yeah, oh, you can try this. Front wheel. Okay, I'm trying to do it better. So it was really interesting watching Ellen's process. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> She tried a bunch of different techniques. At one point, she got off her bike and was even sort of measuring the distance between each stair and her front and rear tires. So my initial thought was that I was gonna ride them how I would normally ride Belgian stairs. And then I saw these and cased my front wheel on the second stair immediately and realized that they were a little bit too long to be able to do both jumps at the same time. Time, I had to start thinking about a different way to get up them. So I'm gonna be pulling the front wheel up and then ratcheting with the rear wheel. It's about kind of finding another fast way to get up them, but once you eliminate the ability to sort of like pump the stairs, it becomes a little bit more complicated. A really important part of being a professional cyclocross racer is to spend over an hour every day making something that isn't complicated, extremely complicated. <laughs> Like that. I didn't mean to do any of that, but it did happen. <laughs> so do you want to start with like stair riding 101 and then do you want to go to the advanced technique or just like straight in? I definitely want to start with 101. Okay, okay. All right, let's okay. see it. All right. Yes. I got over the first stair and I was like, oh, this isn't that hard. And then I started going sideways. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> Get the yes! Ah! <laughs> Amazing! If that was gonna be the way I had to ride my bike up these stairs every day, I, I probably wouldn't do it. I want to say you made it look easy, but you didn't. Grabbing the fence is, it's a go-to cycle cross move, well accepted in cycle cross racing fence grabbing, so I feel comfortable about that. <laughs> <laughs> um, my second attempt was still not pretty, but it was better. Like I said, you have to believe that you can do it. That's true. <laughs> yeah. Oh God, get out of the way. Get out of the way. He's going. <laughs> Woo! I mean, that wasn't as bad as the first time, right? No, that was awesome. So like, I mean, you got 50% nice. <laughs> better. Nice. Yes. Yeah. I think I know what you need to do for the, like, for the final, like, 10%. Because, like, you did it. This is how you do it, like, smoothly. When you're ratcheting the front wheel, yes, as it's up in the air, push it a little bit. That's going to make all the difference in terms of getting up the stairs smoothly because I was having quite a bit of uh, trouble making it smoothly at first. So much smoother! That was good. That was awesome. Yeah. That was like perfect. 
Ellen, thanks for coming and helping us solve the Flow Sport Stair Challenge. You have literally changed my life for the better. <laughs> you know, now will I not only ride up these stairs, but people are gonna be impressed and I'll probably maybe even get a race. You are amazing. I hope you're proud. Thank you. Can I get a high five? Yeah.